What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Lifestyle, 704 on the end, and I'm proud, period. I'm in a good mood today, y'all. I just got through doing some steps and some uh, laps. Well, honestly, I'm be honest. Today was more of a cardio step day. I did do one big lap, but it wasn't your traditional um, track. So, I've burned hundreds of calories today, and it's not even 11 o'clock. So, I just wanted to check in with you guys. Hope all is well. I know it's been a minute since I posted. I just went on some other type shit, y'all, for real. Like, it's a whole lifestyle self, lifestyle change. I was finna say lifestyle something for change. And it is. It is. I'm just on some other stuff. I kind of been on another look. Um... Just on some other shit lately. Uh, and I'm with it. I'm with the shits lately. Seriously. Like, my body is my focus. My One of my top five focuses right now. Because, you know, I'm a mom and a wife. And, and I can't, um, you know, I can't let that shit fall by the wayside. But... My body is in the top five, okay? So, I'm going hard. Seriously hard right now until I, I feel like I don't want to go hard no more, period. It ain't no ain't no end. I don't know the end, you know? And the purpose of... Not the purpose. The formula to a successful weight loss goal or a better lifestyle change is just pure consistency, period. And it really don't take much. But effort. Um, when you're trying to lose weight, it's not a lot. I'm not really into the whole count calories. I'm just not into it. I do. I am mindful of some things, everything that I put in my mouth, especially even if it's not good for me. I know even putting it in my mouth that you know, you know, you're gonna have to pay for this, right? <laughs> everything. So, okay, y'all. Uh, all right, y'all. Yeah, we are at Ollie's. Looking for random stuff, y'all. I'm trying to get in that rug, but my husband's slipping. Baby, we do need a rug. Why you need over Six ninety nine. Stick it in that one you just got. Six ninety nine. What's that? Six by nine. Oh, six by nine. Hey, this is a snake. This is a snake. Oh, I thought it was. So hopefully. <laughs> look, y'all, look how big these. Look how big that rug is. Look how big. When I get my dream house, I'm gonna have a room big enough for these. Well, at least I'm gonna come back and buy all y'all shit. Y'all gonna want me to come back and get it. So we're at Ollie's. Um, literally just got out the house. I was supposed to be taking Samaria to a little birthday party. Ugh, sorry. But I ran out of time. I had unexpected guests today so it, it kind of ran over the, the time allotment that I had to do this little party this, this wasn't a party it was one of my homegirls little girl's birthday and they just invited Samaria over but time got away from me so we are always yeah babe all right y'all we're in Hobby Lobby I don't know why my camera is looking like it's got this glare but look like it got a glare don't it there you got come on I've been wiping it. I don't know why I look like that. That camera don't, but that one do. I, I feel like if since I put that thing on there. Could be. If since I put the um the new cover, yeah. 
Yeah. All right, so we're in Hobby Lobby, y'all. Yeah. I got a new screen safe screen cover. Say hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> um, so ever since I put that overlay on, it's kind of been making my camera look a little foggy. Because the back side don't look like that, period. The back side. So anyway, we're in here. And we're looking for some jars for Chubby Bay. Mommy, look, I mean. But they're not in a pack. Put them on the shade Yes. Yeah. No. Just to start out. You're in the right, yeah. Okay, because you want to let your butter to stretch. You want to be able to sell more containers right. per whatever you buy as far as butter. Get up, you go you off a bigger one. Then you can jump to like stuff like this. You got to see Look this. Here. Okay, look. Hold on that for more. You see yeah, it? I was talking yeah. about business. And, well, logic, really. Yeah. All right, y'all. Here's my OOTD. Not today, nothing major. My Lane Brown was having... I think Lane Brown or actually still is having a mad sale with all their capris shorts for 20 bucks. So this is one of the pairs I got. And a cute little ruffle shirt. Yeah, I've been working out like crazy. I can really see my stomach going down. So I feel good about that. And some cute little shoes I found at um Ross, I believe. Mama, come on. Good morning. Morning, morning, morning. So, I am on my way. I don't know where I'm going, but I thought I'd bring my ponytail along. <laughs> it's the next day, by the way, y'all. It's Sunday. And my body will not allow me to sleep in even on a Sunday I, I've been woke since uh, 6.46 when I decided let me grab my phone and see what time it is so I, I laid there probably another hour and I just couldn't go back to sleep you know, with the summertime, the sun be out early, and my room is really dark on purpose, but if there's a crack or anything to the smallest to let sunlight in, it comes, and I was just sitting there like, all this daylight, I gotta get up. I'm drinking my, uh, y'all ever heard of Organifi? My sister gave me this. I don't know what it is. I guess it's like a um, like a, a drink. Uh, it's a powder that you put in water, of course, and it helps with energy and uh, metabolic uh, issues or stimulation and a host of other things. So I didn't have time to. Oh, I forgot my fruit cup. I didn't have time to eat anything. So when I don't have time to eat and I want to get up and get a, a workout in or walk in, I've been drinking this. Sorry if it's too loud, but I want to make sure the powder mix. And it's berry flavor, so. Uh, I don't even know where I'm going. I literally got up and was like, I want to go to Crowder's Mountain. All right, y'all. I'm here. I made it. And I'm literally nervous because I've never done this before. It is a lot of black people here, so that's pretty cool. So that gives me courage and uh, hope. <laughs> but I'm nervous. And I'm almost about to talk myself out of this, literally. Like almost i've been speaking to everybody and asking questions like you know just our first time you know are you 
Are y'all on y'all way up? Are y'all on your way down? Like, how was it? How long is it gonna be? You said 1.2, I'm sorry. I'm, it, oh, that's the one I need to do then. Yeah. So, um, I'm ear hustling, trying to just see. Because there's obviously multiple routes. And I did speak to someone that said, one of them was, it's gonna take two hours. I don't know if I wanna do this for two hours on my first go round by myself. All right, y'all, wish me luck. Two hours later. What's up, y'all? So, I'm back in the car. And I wasn't able to, I wasn't able to do the, the hike, <laughs> okay? Oh, man, I did about 22 minutes. And I quickly, quickly realized that I couldn't finish. And I think I'm just having a moment because I've just been pushing myself so hard lately and I can't stand for shit to conquer me. And I just can't stand it. Like, I can't believe I couldn't do it. My shins, first of all, my calves really, really hurt today from the steps yesterday. But, I mean, I wasn't going to let that, you know, bother me or whatever, or even stop me from doing this. But I got about 20, what, 20, 20, 20, 22 minutes in and realized that I couldn't go any further like this. I mean, it was the most uncomfortable thing. And I'm just having a moment because I've been pushing myself so hard and to know that I can't do this. I can do it, but I can't do it today. It's just, it's just, it's just fucking with me, that's all, you know? And it's only gonna make me go harder, even harder to, make sure I conquer this. It's only going to make me go harder. So, you know, I'm not going to cry, even though I feel like I want to cry. I can barely even look in the camera. I can't even look y'all in y'all eyes right now because I don't know. I just feel conquered, you know, and I am the conqueror, but I couldn't go. I, I, My body wouldn't let me do it. My legs, not my body, it's just my legs. I should have definitely um, wore my compression socks. I got all these excuses, which is bullshit. I mean, it's true. These are true facts. It's just, I can't believe I allowed that to stop me. I don't allow things to stop me. I, I do what I set out to do. And But this right here, I can't even look y'all in your eyes because I just feel... I feel weak, you know, and I, I don't know if y'all know about zodiac signs, but I'm a Leo, and we don't bow down to shit, but you know what, Crowder's Mountain, you got me today, only because I had steps yesterday. I can't even believe I'm giving the steps that much power, y'all. But I swear to God, like, I was so uncomfortable 20 minutes in. I'm like, the, the route I took was going to be two hours, which is good. I'm like, okay, an hour up and then an hour back down. That's cool. I didn't do the crowd of mountain when I did. The, I was doing the pinnacle. First of all, when I started the pinnacle, I realized this route is probably shorter because it's the most steep. Mm. Oh, excuse me. I really feel like getting my ass back out, back out and going again and getting to the top. I see older people, younger people, people got their kids out here, you know, and 
No Jen, Lifestyle 704. Can't get her ass up the route. Because her legs won't let her. I feel so... So helpless. I don't want to use helpless because I really feel like I'm about to get my ass back out and try this shit again. And part of me is like, Jaren, you just talk to yourself about embracing things. And if right now in this moment, you feel like 22 minutes is all you could do today, then 22 minutes is what it is. You're going to get your ass back out there. Eventually, you're going to try it again. I'm going to tell you right now, I keep saying, oh, I got this I want to do by the time my birthday comes. I got this I want to do by the time my birthday comes. This right here has made the, made the list, okay? It's a couple of things I want to do by, by August 14th. This right here, just put this shit on the list too. But I'm going to get this shit done before the 14th though. Like I may come back out here during the week. I don't know. Part of me just felt like it would have been nice to have somebody here with me to talk to and and get my mind off of how far we had to go up but then again it's like I feel like I need all my strength like I really don't need to be wasting a lot of breath talking but I, I'm a good listener though so I if, if there was somebody that wanted to go with me that was gonna talk <laughs> I didn't mind listening you know every now and again I'd be like mm -hmm, yeah something like that but that would have helped that, that would have helped me out it would have I just, I don't know what would have helped me out. I can't depend on anybody to push me as hard as I want to go, but only me. So I'm sorry, y'all. I just had a little moment. So sorry. I really had an emotional moment. Even coming down, that, coming back down, I was just like so mad at myself. But I did take the first step in succumbing, so... Y'all just watch out for me. It's about to be on. When something conquers me and I feel like I can't do it, oh, I push until I do it, period. If you don't know me about that, you know now. Hell, I, I know now. Ugh, I'm not going to allow this. I'm not going to allow this to take over, take over me or my mind. Like, as a matter of fact, I'm going to go hard. Um, I'm going to go back to Charlotte and go super hard on the track somewhere and just, just go. Maybe even do some more steps today. I don't know. But this is not the end of me today. Y'all, thank y'all for watching. I know this was a a vlog, a vlog that's been all over. But it was something I just wanted to get out to y'all for encouragement. And um, just to let y'all know really where I am right now. We're still going to be eating. But um, I just, it's going to be a little different. I still want to eat whatever I want to eat. But it's, everything is good in moderation. I can't be... You know, if, if I have a goal that I want to meet, I cannot sit around and eat. I'm going to have to modify some things. Like yesterday, I went to Five Guys, and I got exactly what I wanted, but I got it on lettuce wrap instead of a bun. I saved 240 calories just with that. So, yeah, make sure y'all like, share, comment down below. I pray that y'all see my weakness as a strength. In some some way, some shape, fashion, form or fashion. And know that I'm going to get to the top. Y'all going to see me because I'm going to bring y'all with me. All right. I love y'all. See y'all next time. Peace.